Let's go. The Panthers out to defend their trophy. And the Stingrays out to win two out of two from the Panthers in the group stage. Galbraith straight on the attack round Lee. Fired one into the stick of Kowalski. Chilcott plays it back towards goal and it misses. And it's picked up by Greg Jacina. And already the atmosphere is loud and intense inside the Hull Arena. Chilcott keeps the puck in the zone. Boxhill tries to free it. And Stingrays have won it back with lows on. Nicely plays the puck around Boxhill and he's drawn a penalty from the Panthers. And as Kowalski stops it, Mike Hicks will make his call. Farmer has to be pulled away from going after Carl Lozon. And it's Greg Yacina heading across to the penalty box. And the Stingrays will go on an early power play. Played around by Jameson, Kowalski's out to deal with it and Meyer was trying to cut him off. Stingrays have got the puck back to Chartrain. Now for Corey Tanaka. Mayer squeezes in. Oh, he's been Kowalski! And the Stingrays have only their fifth power play goal of the season. And it's a go-ahead goal. And the Stingrays are doing it to the Panthers once again. Just opened up there for Cody Wilde to step into the play. Now Lark's around Lee. Lark with the move, the save, the follow-up. Tanaka's put it wide. Oh my goodness, Tanaka can't believe it. Collision right in front of the goal between Lark and Kowalski. Back with Lee. Lawrence moves it in and it's beaten Brown 5-hole. And the Panthers have got a power play leveller. So let's check the replay. And allowed to skate in unchallenged. And Brown might feel he could have done a little more. As the puck goes underneath him and in for an equaliser at 12.06. Tanaka shoots on goal and it is caught by Kowalski. And we got a little bit of pushing and shoving. And a little bit of face washing in front of the goal involving Farmer. Towner is in the middle of it. Well, the farmer's never been the most popular player here at the Hull Arena, and that's certainly one of improved relations with the supporters. And the refs happy to let it go. We'll continue five on five with a face off to the left of Kowalski. So back out of the attacking zone, sorry. And he plays it back in. And the Stingrays will now try and carry it out. Char train. Gains the red line and dumps it in deep. Kowalski will settle it down. And he'll flick it around the glass. And the clearance doesn't get out. Lozon has taken it. But he just got crowded out a little. No way through the middle that time. And we're inside the final 10 seconds. Tanaka. He's got time to get a long shot away. The Stingrays will not be able to do that as the puck is just beyond Havato. And the first period comes to an end. And what a very good first period it has been. Action and chances at both ends, and a power play goal apiece. And hopefully we'll get a period as entertaining as the first. Lots of action, lots of chances. And a level game as the second period gets underway. Jacina will chase this one in. Chartrain gets there first, but Jacina's won it back. Boxhill tries to take over. It'll come around to Wild. Boxhill with a little bit of room, tries to play the pass and then decides against it. Chartrain lifts it against the board, Galbraith with a little backhand out, it's a little bit beyond Lozon, so he'll turn and head to the bench. And Panthers will play the puck into the zone, Jameson will reach it before Clark. Clark will put the pressure on and Jameson will keep hold of it. And backhanded out of the zone, but it's gone a little bit too far for the Stingrays. And it'll be an icing call and play back into the Stingrays end. A lot of love for Big Eric here from the Stingrays, that's given away to Wild. Opportunity and Farmer's shot is saved by Brown and the follow-up is saved by Brown as well. A penalty is coming against the Stingrays and it's starting to get a little nasty. And we've got a little bit of wrestling behind the goal. And I won't be surprised if this starts to boil over. Couple of good saves in the middle of all that from David Brown. Davis has had his helmet ripped off. And he's got a few words for oh, Jonathan Boxhill. A few other players have paired off. Farmer looks to be the angry man of the scene. 
we wait to see what the penalties is going to be. It looks as though it's going to be on Matty Davis. An important four minutes coming up in their Challenge Cup campaign. If Lozon could get this to Meyer, there was a break on. And Lozon just couldn't play the pass to where Meyer could bring it in. Oh, what a giveaway by Kowalski and Meyer. Couldn't control it with his stick and put it into what would have been an unguarded net. Nottingham very nearly careless. Kowalski very nearly gave away the softest possible goals. Clark with a big slap shot and Brown has saved it and held on. The Stingrays want to make sure that Bruce Graham is nowhere near their goalie. Chaff train around the board. Schmidt will keep this in. Send it towards goal and the save is made by Brown. The puck's underneath him. And he's just about got it trapped. That was an awkward one. And he did well to not let it get away. David Brown with a shutout last night. Beaten once by Lawrence in this game, but he's had a good second period. Opportunity here for Lark! He's hit the underside of the bar and it stayed out. My goodness, could that have been any closer? The ref said no, the goal judge says no, and the Stingrays fans say oh no. Final 20 seconds of the period, Lakovic. There's Davis all over him. And he needs Oakford there to help him out. Final few seconds. Can the Stingrays generate something? The pass is just out of the reach of Davis. That one is flipped up into the air. It has hit the lights above us. So there are three ticks left on the clock. And the face-off will come into the Panthers zone. So a chance for the Stingrays if they can win the draw to get a shot away. A similar passage of play that led to the Matt Lark chance will do them nicely. And it's Tanaka who's taking this face off and Lozon who's lurking, waiting for it. But it's been knocked away to the corner and the hooter sounds to signal the end of the period. And again, Farmer getting involved in a little bit of pushing and shoving after the whistle. But it has been a scoreless period. It is not, it is Dan Green in goal for the Nottingham Panthers. We're hearing Kowalski has strained his groin. Unconfirmed reports as the shot from Lozon goes over the top. So a big moment in the game potentially. The Panthers come forward through Robinson and the shot is saved by Brown. Here's Lark, pinching in, trying to get a shot on the way on the backhand. Wild doesn't let him, he just tied him up. Just caught up in amongst the legs and the sticks behind the goal. Move back to Chilcott. Shoots through traffic, oh, and that one's come up. And it has hit Matt Lark. And a guy who's had no luck in front of goal. Has had the puck come up, and I think it may have hit him. An immediate concern for Matt Lark. Tanaka watches over him. Novato comes in. Oakford. Oh, he's done well. Oakford's moving in. This is danger. This is a goal for the Panthers. And Oakford has got it. Stepping up from the blue line and beating Brown. And putting the Panthers in front for the first time tonight. Now the Stingrays will try and counter through Davis. Osman goes towards the goal. Davis drops it back for Meyer, who shoots. It's gone on to Green, and the Stingrays have equalised. And the Mayor has done it again. Jordan Mayer, his second of the night, his ninth of the season, is a game-tying goal. The Stingrays can get one clearance. Might just be enough for them, but they're not able to do that. The Panthers have it, and a chance to set up. Final 10 seconds. And that shot goes wide of the goal. If Chartrain reaches it, he should be able to clear it. He does, and that will do it. We will go to overtime, and both teams will take at least one point from this Challenge Cup game. It's Ricci again, his second power play goal of the period. Well, overtime is underway here. Four on three in the Panthers' favour. And the Panthers find a winner. Robinson. 
Lee, Graham's in front of the net, Lawrence is on the near side. Lee moving in, Robinson. One timer, and it's saved by Brown, who got across just in the nick of time. Oh, and Mosey is taking it around Lozon and has got a chance to win it, and Brown's made a great save with the blocker. And there's no penalty call for the hit on Mosey in the corner. Here comes Davis with Lozon. Davis moving, chance to win it, and the save by Green. Thirty seconds still of three on three. Green makes another save. Wild settles it down. It was played with a high stick. Final few seconds. Oh, and he's left the puck behind. That could have been really costly. And it still might be out of the box. Here's Robinson into the play, and he's got Graham in support. Chance for the Panthers, and it's knocked away by Galbraith, and the Panthers have slapped it home. It's Robinson with the winner. And the Stingrays have shot themselves in the foot as the Panthers came off the penalty kill and went into the offensive zone and won the game. It's Robinson's goal, it's the Panthers' victory. And they are celebrating, their fans are on their feet.